friends revolutionaries and happy Halloween Eve or the night before Halloween <laughs> it's your last chance to get your costume together if you haven't done it get on it I I don't have mine I don't have mine I don't have anything planned it's something where my plans for, for this month just kind of went up in smoke so <laughs> it's one of the things where yeah I, I will find something to, to, to do uh, tomorrow night but that doesn't bother me nearly as much as the fact that October is the start of the peeps season and of course I love my peeps I look forward to peeps all year and uh, and if what this right here if what we have right here is any indication we may not be having a great peep season because let me tell you whereas uh, if you remember back in Easter this was packed <laughs> this was full of some really great peeps goodies this year or you know for October this is all I was able to find this is it I mean on top of the fact that normally I can find the large sets of the pumpkins and the ghosts, um, the black cats, which I still haven't been able to find, uh, they've got some chocolate dip peeps. There's usually always the pumpkin dipped peep, the chocolate pumpkin peep. Could not find any of that this year. I went to all my regular haunts, nothing. And I don't mean like the same thing, I mean nothing. <laughs> the only place I found these was at my local Walgreens. And this is all they had. This was it for peeps in my area. So, uh, so I mean, I waited until now because, of course, you know, we're going to end the, uh, the, the, the month with a great treat. But uh, I was also hoping that some, at, the, at the last minute I might still find some. Didn't happen. <laughs> so, so this is not a good sign for this year's peep season, for the peep season this year, 2012 and 2013 season. Keep my fingers crossed that uh, Christmas is going to be better, but uh, not looking good so far. But I did get these, which, as I pointed out, we do have the single pack pumpkins. <laughs> the poor pumpkins. They try so hard. In their purple packaging. There you go. Marshmallow pumpkins. Peeps. On the back, it's got the seasons. As I pointed out, here is Halloween, Christmas, Valentine's, and Easter. And it's about every other month, there's, a, there's another Peeps holiday coming up. So, yeah, it'll be about six months, seven months of, of Peeps. That's going to be great. And for anybody who, uh, who happens to, uh, to be this, I, I've got a co-worker that will be happy to know. Peeps are gluten-free. So, <laughs> if you haven't tried Peeps because you're, you're, uh, you have a gluten reaction, don't worry. They're safe. So, uh, so let's go ahead and uh, first open these up. I got to say, I do like the fact they've changed the packaging on the single packs. They're not just that cellophane wrapper anymore that used to like dump out the sugar everywhere. They actually have a much better package. Makes, would, would make them easier to store. That's for sure. They wouldn't go stale as fast. But uh, much nicer packaging here. So we should expect to have a much fresher peat. <laughs> and, of course, sprinkly orange sugar everywhere. <laughs> so let's go ahead and break off a couple of pumpkins. <laughs> Seriously, they do try so hard. I mean, they look more like bunny rabbits. They do. They look like little bunny heads. I mean, Peeps really needs to add like a little stem on top because <laughs> it's either it's either a heart <laughs> or maybe it's a little bunny face. It's not to, it's not quite the kind of pumpkin. And every year, I think they get further and further away from pumpkins. But uh, just a little white marshmallow inside. Got the little candy dip faces and that delicious marshmallow inside. Oh, oh, oh. mmm. Been this been since Easter. I've been waiting. Oh man, you're good. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Oh, oh, good stuff. <laughs> good, good stuff. Hold off on this for a second. Take a look at the ghosts. The ghosts are very cool. I got three in the pack here. Got the little boo all around the packaging. 
Yeah, so let's see about opening up our ghosts. And the packaging actually does keep much fresher, <laughs> I gotta say. That's a pretty fresh station marshmallow. <laughs> let's take the ghosts out. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> kind of, there you go. <laughs> See, you can have all kinds of fun with peeps. <laughs> and just break one off. And he looks like he's kind of got a little, like a little hair thing going there, like a little, uh, a little vampire point there at the tip of his head. I, I don't think, no, no, the others kind of have a little hair thing too. That one's kind of cool. It certainly looks better than the others as far as, oh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I think that one turned out best <laughs> as far as having a little hair, maybe a little hand on the end. Yeah, that one turned out, def that one definitely turned out the best. Mmm. Tastes like it too. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. You know, if they want to celebrate, uh, well, never mind. <laughs> I won't say it. <laughs> look at like a little part in his hair kind of thing. <laughs> With ghosts, I think the I think one of the cool things about the ghosts is that even when the uh, even when the marshmallow starts to drip, it works because it's a ghost. You know, <laughs> the drip just kind of goes with the whole ghostly kind of you know wavy, you know ethereal, whatever kind of thing. Cool. <laughs> oh. Mm, mm, mm. As usual, guys, make sure you brush your teeth after this. Oh, man, these are not, these are certainly not good. Well, <laughs> they're good, they're delicious. Just make sure to, to take care of yourself afterwards. Uh, lastly, there's the marshmallow uh, treats crisp, uh, crispy rice thingy. <laughs> uh, very much probably like the uh, like the blue chick that we got from uh, that we got from uh, Easter. We go ahead and open this up, and inside. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, it's clearly supposed to be a pumpkin. It's one of the things where he's got a little stem on top. And I'm guessing that's supposed to be his mouth in there, if you can kind of make out that hollow crevice. And there should be some eyes right there. It does have little, uh, like, little dots, little pumpkin uh, sprinkles over it. The the chocolate and the, the vanilla and... I guess the orange. <laughs> but yeah, like a little Rice Krispie treat. So, uh, so let's, let's give it a try. Mm. <laughs> this will take a moment. <laughs> Not quite the same shock of sugar <laughs> that we get from the classic peeps, but still good. <laughs> still really good. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> nice addition. I like the addition of the of the crisps. Very nice addition to them. I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll wrap things up just by saying that, yeah, you know, it's a little disappointing seeing all the great stuff that Peeps has out there and the fact that this year didn't really get, get a whole lot. I'm really hoping uh, Christmas is going to be a lot better. Really looking forward to getting those, uh, those uh, chocolate mousse reindeer again. Those are going to be good. But, um, but yeah, yep. Yeah. Wasn't going to be Halloween without peeps. Hope everybody enjoyed watching. Have a great Halloween. Rate, comment, subscribe. Join the revolution. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.